We're now going to look at how to fit a Cox proportional hazards model in STATA. Again, we're going to restrict to those between ages 40 and 44 at baseline in the Framingham data set. Anytime we're analyzing survival data in STATA, we first have to ST set our data or declare our data to be survival time data. Time variable is time death and the failure variable is death. So we're looking at time to death among participants 40 to 44 years old. To fit a Cox proportional hazards model in STATA, I can go to the statistics menu choose survival analysis, regression models, and choose the first option which is Cox proportional hazards model. The command for running a Cox model in STATA is STCOX. In the independent variables window I can just insert the variables that I want to include in my model. For instance if I want to include smoking status, age, and baseline systolic blood pressure I would put those into the independent variables window. So again, the regression command for running the Cox model looks a lot like the previous regression commands that we've run, except you no longer put the outcome variable as the first variable in your list. Because you've already ST set your data, Stata knows what the outcome variable is. It knows that we're looking at time to death already. So all that you need to put in the command for ST Cox is the independent variables that you're interested in looking at. Scrolling down and looking at the output from the hazards model, we see that if we just run the straightforward version of the Cox model, it outputs for us hazard ratios or exponentiated coefficients. We talked in class about how really most of the time we don't want the hazard ratios, but it's better to have Stata actually present the regression coefficients or the betas. To get Stata to output the betas rather than the hazard ratios, you go to the reporting tab and select report coefficients, not hazard ratios. Another way to achieve this is after the stcox command with your independent variables, you insert comma no hazard ratio or no hr. When this option is used, you now see that Stata outputs the regression coefficients. These are the betas. If you want to look at any combinations of the betas or any of the exponentiated betas, we can again use the lincom command. So if I run lincom cursemoke1 comma eform, I end up learning that the hazard ratio of death for smokers versus non-smokers is 1.86, fixing age and systolic blood pressure at baseline.